I just lifted a bunch of rocks because next to water like that is a nice place for snakes to hide. Most people's first response to a snake is to run away from it. ONW sophomore Jared Coker has a different reaction. Uh, what I like to do in my free time is go out and catch snakes. Coker has always had a fascination with snakes, and his hobby allows him to enjoy them even more. I started snake catching because snakes had always fascinated me, so I thought I'd get a little more up close. Jared's fascination with snakes overcomes his fear of getting bit. I do worry about that, but not too much. If it's a non-venomous snake, then a, a bite really won't mean anything, but uh, I try not to get bit, obviously. His parents are more scared of him getting lost than being bitten. I worry more about him, you know, getting lost, falling on his bike or something if he does that kind of thing. So, but most of the time he'll take his phone with him and, you know, we know about where he is when he's coming back, that kind of thing. And I don't worry too much about the snakes. He has gotten some little bites, but most of them are little enough that it's not really an issue. According to Jared's mom, he gets a lot of support from the family. His dad put him together a big um, snake log for him, actually uh, had it made and um, worked up the pages with a spreadsheet, you know, for all the snakes he catches, how many length and everything so he can keep track of them that way. So we support him behind the scenes, I guess. <laughs> Coker is quite the avid snake catcher. He even has his own YouTube channel dedicated to documenting his best finds. Here's just a really good look at this prairie king snake. I thought I'd give him another close-up because I don't find these very often. They're really cool. For ONW Now, this has been Adam Cook. Don't try this at home. Now back to the desk.